Yeah, dude. It's all about that one. This one? Yeah. That's what I want. It's the one that uh, John was telling me about. He was like... Yeah, I signed up already, but I wanted to get a spare just in case. Yeah, it's, it's, I think we sign up for it, you start next month. Oh, okay. Yeah. Nice. See you, Brian. Later, man. Gonna put that Thursday. <laughs> yeah, man, we're almost there. <laughs> oh man, that's what's up. I've been missing it. I've been Raiders. We 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 had a hell of a game against. Man, one of the best games that they've had in a minute. Derek Carr looked righteous. <laughs> Later, bro. I mean, Lamar Jackson was doing his thing, but. Man, he look good. My Raiders, my Raiders. My UPS hub, as you see behind me, coming through security, talking to the security guy from leaving Twilight Shift. And uh, nice Mercedes. I like that color. Um, I don't always make a video. Some birds flying around. Mm -hmm. Some ducks or something. Anyways, I don't always make a video when I leave. Unless I have something pertinent to tell you guys about what's going on at UPS or at the hub or whatever. So what's going on is they are hiring at my hub for lots of positions, but uh, within the hub, so like out, outside the hub, if you wanna, if you have a class A driver's license, you can get hired immediately. UPS will pick you up. You have to have like a year of experience and a good clean driving record. And then UPS will hire you literally off the street just by having a class A driver's license, which is the tractor trailer. And you will then be able to be in the union, get all the benefits associated with being a UPS employee, a union employee, uh, the medical dental, the whole shebang, you know, when, once it kicks in after nine months. Um, but I know somebody who has a Class A license, so I passed that information on to him. But he's working at a, at a trucking company that he that he likes. So I think he's going to stay right there, which is it's fine. That's his prerogative. Um, but. Uh, the other thing is within the hub, if you look on the job board, you see things. Not everybody checks the job board here. I do. So I signed up for something. And I'll show you what it is. It is the driver helper. I don't know if you can see that. Driver helper. So I already, this is a spare. I already signed up. My boss is all about it. He's all for it. He's like, you got it. I'll sign off on it. So um, basically what a driver helper is, you wear also the same uniform that the UPS guys wear, which is the brown, you know, shirt, brown shorts, and whatever shoes you wear is whatever shoes you wear. Um, a lot of those guys, We'll wear sneakers because you're running around which is good but in the warehouse i wear work shoes like leather work shoes like steel toes because there's nails there's wood there's a lot of stuff that can ding you up pretty good but in the truck you can wear something light and you know comfortable because you're gonna be in and out of the truck so what a driver helper does is 
there's two guys, the driver and the driver helper. It gets busy in the, in the uh, season that we're about to hit, which is holidays and peak and all that, whatever they want to call it. So because of that, they need driver helpers to help the drivers deliver the packages or pick up packages. You get you gain experience being inside the truck, so the driver's gonna help you, he's gonna teach you whatever his years of experience are, or her years of experience are at being a driver helper or being a driver or whatever, so you can pick up that that trade. You get whatever your rate of pay is, if you've been here three or four years, you get a raise every year. So if you're making 16 an hour, you get a dollar more while you're driver helper. So whatever your rate of pay is, you go up one dollar for the time you're driver helper. The driver helper thing starts October the 1st, which is in like two weeks. So I just noticed this today, so it's obviously new, which is good. I'm in now before it runs out and uh, I'm gonna sign up for it. And uh, I did sign up for it. So anyways, I start the driver training thing. As soon as my boss signs off on it, he'll give me the approval, you know, tomorrow probably. And then October 1st is gonna be whoever signed up our first day. And they need like a bunch of guys. I, I think they said they needed like 15 or 20. So, you know, everybody's got a pretty good shot at getting it. And they usually pull from the package handlers, which is what I do, because we get first, we, we see that job board first, because we come in that way, and I don't know. It's just, most of the other workers around there, they already like what they do. So they don't want to be driver helpers, most of the time. Um, you get a dollar more an hour, you, you work the driver's shift, you work his route or her route or whatever her schedule is. So usually the drivers, I think they start at like seven in the morning and you'll work all day until three or four or five because their days are like nine or 10 hours. So whatever you make past eight hours is time and a half. And you can work six days. You can come in on Saturdays because we're Monday through Friday, but you can work Saturdays. And I think they encourage it, which I will do. <laughs> I will work Saturdays. So it's looking like it's probably going to be a six day a week thing and it's going to go for uh until january 15th so october november december and then january 15th that's like almost four months so for f about three and a half months i'm going to be a full-time driver helper uh doing that um at like whatever the rate of pay is like like a dollar more so i'll be getting like 16 because we i think we just got a raise later man later. i think we just got a raise to 15 or, or we're gonna get a raise to 15. so then it'll go to 16 because a dollar more so 16 an hour uh nine or ten hours a day six days a week so saturday's all time and a half and anything past eight hours on saturday is double time so it's going to be a nice Christmas. <laughs> so that's what I had to pass on. And if you if you're if you're a class A certified driver, man, come to UPS and get a job. They will hire you off the street. You don't have to go through all the nonsense of being in the hub a year and all that waiting and seniority. They just want experienced, safe uh, class A drivers who have at least one year on the road driving with a truck trucking company that they can background check you for and that you're, you have a valid Class A license, no DUIs, your license is valid, you know, the whole shebang. They're gonna check that, and they're gonna check your references at the last trucking company you worked at where you have your one year minimum experience. So, I'm passing that on to you guys. Thanks for watching, I'll keep it short. I'm hungry, I'm gonna go eat, shower, I'm filthy. Look at my shirt. Get dirty in there. All right, thanks for watching.